We were at Costco today. We bought some butter croissants at Costco. We ended up getting two packs of these little beauties. Number one child wanted some croissants with cheese and ham in them. We have some cheese, but the only ham we have is freeze-dried ham. So we're going to open up this pack. This is from clear back on batch 60. So a little over four and a half years ago. It's been sitting out at room temperature for four and a half years. Hopefully it's still good. So these are the old bags before we even had zipper tape bags. It smells perfect in there. This is a pretty good size. Sli oh my gosh, these are big slices. <laughs> I didn't get the right container. Okay, well, we can work with that. And we'll get the little oxygen absorber. And So this pack, like I said, is from over four and a half years ago. Ham for freeze drying and rehydrating is one of my favorites. It freeze dries well and it rehydrates ridiculously quick. But I didn't realize how big these pieces were. Um, hmm. Well, might have to add more water. So I've got just some ice water I'm going to pour over it. And you can see it starts to rehydrate extremely quickly. Yeah, look at that. This would have just snapped just a minute ago. Oh, I should have used a Ziploc. I'm going to switch this to a Ziploc. Don't go away. Did anybody go away? Call them back. Yeah, I should have just put this all in a Ziploc. Because then it'll kind of conform around there. It's probably almost finished already. You can see nice and squishy already. Some of the thicker pieces might take a whole minute. Okay, so some of these thicker edges still might not be 100%. We'll check that. And back to nice juicy ham again. But that's probably long enough. Now what's happening with these? Okay. Well, I was going to say you could. Yeah, a delicious turkey. <laughs> Ooh, actually. That sounds way better than. Doing a quick cut to see what I could do with cutting it part way open, but not cut through Ooh. the other crust piece. There, like that. Okay. And then you could fill it however you want. Mm. Just like ham. Okay. Now what? All right. Beautiful. <laughs> yeah. Half? I'm gay. Yeah. I can do a diagonal too. Right, then you have it, and you've got a pocket there. The outside is so crisp, you can gently, yeah. let, maybe that. Okay. Interesting. Ah, oh, yeah. Kind of wrap that around. And move it way forward for the next one. Especially when you lift, because the angles are weird. Yeah. Thanks. Oops, not that way where I can't see what I'm doing. And then that cheese in the middle will kind of help melt it and glue it together. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. So the one in half this way, the one poked in yeah stuffed like a turkey and one slice this way off and on i've used mountain house freeze-dried foods for more than 40 years 45 50 years but my own stuff never ceases to amaze me when it's sitting on the shelf for four and a half years five years and i get it out and it's still pristine and perfect like it's supposed to be i know 
intellectually and in theory it's all supposed to work but it still surprises me when it does this stuff is so great freeze-dried ham is really good it works so well okay and there it is with melty cheese in the middle and ham on the outside are you gonna cut one of these go for it you can cut that one this one yeah Ah, some nice cheese and ham in the middle. We can cut this one. <laughs> ah, that worked pretty well. But wait, there's more. You can cut through that <laughs> one the rest of the way. Well, that one we could just open it up and check it. Oh, nice. Okay. Hey, snacks are done. <laughs>